there's only one thing left to say. Let's rev it up! All right, guys, welcome back. Okay, so uh, I want to I wanna touch on some synchro strategies that you can use and manipulate the zones because there is there are ways that I just, I was thinking to myself, I can't believe I didn't think, see this sooner. Okay, let's say you, you, you establish your link, right? Your link, your link monster. And there are cards that can manipulate their zones and, and free up space. And then you can use that to strategically place and synchro to whatever it is that you want to accomplish. So like, what I mean by that is like, things that can move themselves and rearrange their zone position are gonna be really, really helpful. Like example, these are the ones, these are just a few that you can, that, that I just thought of, okay, uh, you can deal with this. Like this one, you free up a space by equipping it to another, to something else. Drew, you can just banish it and free up the slot. Omega, same, similar situation, free up the slot. And these as well. Anything that tributes itself and then brings itself back, you can um, use its effect, like Sardis Warrior, and then during end phase, bring it back somewhere else. Same thing with Sardis, you can just free up your slot and bring it somewhere else. That's gonna be really good manipulation to use, so you, that you can use to your advantage. And um, that's gonna be really, really helpful. And then you also have your other situations where you can free up slots without having to wait for them to be destroyed or something you can do like with with diamond dire or scrap dragon you can just like if you know that you, your your goal is to do something else you can just pop this pop something else free up the slot same thing with this you exceed and then pop and then you go on and then so on you get you kind of get the idea now so that's gonna be really really cool and then of course like uh hang on talk about these later and then similar situation where you have like Harold, like you just, it, it, things that, that can um, uh, free up the slot are gonna be really useful. Put that here. And then another thing is gonna be good is synchros that replace themselves. Like example, like, let's say you synchro into Jet Warrior and then you, 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 you synchro climb into Excel. And then you can just use this effect and bring himself back. That's gonna be really useful. So those type of effects are gonna be pretty pretty useful. And something I, I completely missed as well. I was like, like you're guaranteed to see to a, a synchro slot. That's like a given. I can't believe I just didn't think about that. Like you you're pretty much guaranteed a synchro slot, an extra deck slot, which is one. And you can just keep synchroing into it, synchroing into it. I mean, okay, so yeah, synchro, then synchro. And then synchro, like you, you can you, you can take advantage of uh, synchroing into that one slot, but you can uh, that could only take you so far. But the fact that you can just do that, like you can do the the coral charge play on that single slot and draw two, that's pretty damn good still. And um, yeah, that's that's gonna be pretty cool. And then and one of the one of the synchros I think gonna be really really useful. It's gonna be Sohaya. Because Sohaya, it, it, it replaces itself. It's just really, really cool. So pretty much what you do is, you synchro to Sohaya, you'll, you'll level leap. I'll just get the level later. Nice. You'll level leap, and then you just make another one. And then you get, get, it, get its effect, and then special the other one into a different slot you want to keep them free and then if you wanted to you can bring Sardis warrior and then you can use its effect and then special it somewhere else like that's just really really cool so all for that for that combo all you need is gofu and a level leader to get all this to get that that and this all you need is a gofu and uh a level leader that's insane that's pretty damn cool i think that's gonna become more of a uh, of a toolbox uh, sequence that you can use to your advantage seeing that you even your opponent might be limited limited and if you can have access to at least that to at least that that guaranteed scenario it's gonna be you're gonna be pretty ahead 
So I, I'm really liking that. And another one as well is gonna be Denglong. Because Denglong can be used as a material and then and then you can special summon another Yang Zing. I mean add is Yang I'm not even sure what it is what it does. Hang on, let me check. Okay, so if this card is special summon, you can add one card from your deck to your hand. One Zhang Zing card from your deck to your hand. And once per turn, you can send one more type monster from your deck to the graveyard. This card's level becomes the sent monsters. That sent monsters. If this face up card leaves the field, you can special. Yeah, so it replaces itself. So Deng Long is gonna be. It's gonna be in the pile of something that can be used to work around and synergize with Link monsters. That's just really cool. So the more I think about it, the more it seems more possible to do it. You just you gotta I think a bit different. So that's gonna be really, really cool. <laughs> but that's pretty much it. I, I was just, that's all I wanted to cover on this, in this video. And unless they give like a, a link monster that has three, the most slots you can single into are going to be four. But then again, it doesn't mean it's not like it's, yeah, it's not like you actually need the fifth one because if you have four synchros already. It's not like you can make a fifth one, <laughs> you know what I mean? Unless you, unless you could like sink her from hand. That's the only way. But then, uh, yeah, I don't know. But it's, it doesn't seem so bad, unless you like sink link, and then link, and you're gonna have one, two, three, three. I think I think three three slots is enough to be able to get get things going. Yeah, but yeah, it is possible. It's it's possible. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So the more I thought about it, I was like, oh yeah, it's not so bad, but it'd be better if this wasn't involved. Like it's, oh my god, it's so much better. But that's gonna be, oh and I forgot to talk about this one. Okay, so this one, I, I a while back I used to play it, cause it's pretty much a reborn. So if it, it's like, what I mean by like, okay, again, I'll, I'll, I'll give you an example. Like, some strike, um. Vanities, those are powerful cards, but there's no way to access it. it. The only way to get it is either if you have a deck that plays Ariane or if you hard draw it. But if, if you can access something uh, like by making it or or like yeah, pretty much by by having uh, making access to it. Like if, if you can manage to do it and be like, like here's what I mean. The reason why these synchro decks are good, this are decent enough to have some sort of relevance in the meta is because they can toolbox their way through any synchro at pretty much any given time. If they need a scrap dragon, there's a way to make it. Is if they need a crystal wing, there's a way to make it. If there's a, a way to uh, uh, black rose, there's a way to make it. That's why it's so versatile. And if you can find a way to have access to a reborn that's pretty damn good because all you need to do is make sure you're not low enough on life points and crash and let's say you have like a dead um crystal wing you can bring him back and you have a crystal wing just by sinkering into this guy and the the little thing that you needed to do was just crash it so that's pretty that's pretty clever but yeah those are little things that i, I think they're pretty cool but that's gonna be it i gotta do another another um dark synchro deck profile because I haven't done the one in, 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 in a while, so I'll go ahead and do that. I still haven't gotten a hold of a Theseus, so I, I might wait till I do that. Or if not, I'll just do the deck profile I have now without it. Or I could just do it and then just put a little image of Theseus so you get, get an idea that that's Theseus. So I might I, I might end up doing that, but yeah, it's gonna be it. I hope I hope this was helpful. I hope this kind of like uh, give you like a little idea. And that's pretty much gonna be it. <laughs> Thanks for watching.